Trish, I wonder about players who have impressed you for the United States, first of all, at the CONCACAF Gold Cup. Who would your vote go to? Well, we have to talk about Stuart Holden. I mean, uh, I'm not necessarily surprised, you know, and this is where we can't underestimate uh, the, the value and the role of Major League Soccer because these players, you know, have uh, have a platform to play in. And if you watch Houston Dynamo, this is one player that always stands out. Obviously, box-to-box -box sort of player uh, has got the capacity to, to take players on. Of, of course, great, great work rate, uh, a little bit of pace. And, you know, in the positions that we're looking at for the United uh, States, are wide, especially on the left side. He can also play on the right side. I think, you know, this is one player with, uh, where Bob Brown Bradley is going to look at it and say, well, if Lyndon Donovan has to be moved around somewhere or if Dempsey's not playing well on the right-hand side, maybe Stuart Holden can come in. And he certainly proved uh, his worth uh, to me, at least. Born and brought up in Scotland, by the way, in Aberdeen Vice City. He's what that goes away. That's smirk. That's smirk. I, I, that that smirk. That yeah, smirk. Yeah. I knew it was coming. We won't belabor that. With Stuart Holden, the best thing about the CONCACAF Gold Cup is it's given players a chance to play 90 minutes. A lot of these times come in, these players come into camp uh, and will play 15, 20 minutes because you know, they're new players and, and the established players are playing more minutes and it's hard to really make an impact in 15, 20 minutes or 10 minutes and he's been able to get a run of games from 90 minutes. He's been counted on to be an important player for this particular group and this squad at the Gold Cup and he's really come through. I think he's the one player similar to Clint Dempsey in the last World Cup where through MLS he was creative, he scored a lot of goals and he worked his way into the team. I think it's the same situation for Stuart Holden. He's the one guy that I think will make the plane ride over to South Africa and I think will get some playing time. Yes, good luck to him.